Hey friends, here I am welcoming you to all on our YouTube channel Sri Swaminarayan Physiotherapy College, Ahmedabad, Rani. Myself, Dr. Jamesha Panchal. Today, I want to share my experience of treating generalized back pain. But before we beginning, I request you all to please press the bell icon and share, like, and subscribe our channel for the new upcoming updates. Nowadays, back pain is a part of the human condition, like common cold. In current scenario, if I would say 8 out of 10 adults will experience an acute episode of back pain. It is mainly because of the lifestyle and workload. Now, we'll see why that occurs. Yes, there are many causes that leads to back pain, like internal organ pain due to heavy weight lifting or any fall injury on the back. Then if you have a poor sitting posture on your workplace, then frequently bending activities from your back. And lastly, but most importantly, the degenerative or we can say age related changes. These are some signs you may feel if you're having a back pain. The first one is stiffness on your back. Then second one is presence of localized spasm. Then restricted your back movements. Pain also reaches below the knee. Then limiting your prolonged standing, sitting and walking position. Now it's high time to say goodbye to the pain and get your back back. Now. We are moving forward toward our exercise zone. So let's start first mobility exercises or we can say stretching exercises. But take a note that during these exercises do not hold your breath. Now these are some exercises that we will see further. In this you have to take supine position then bend your knees at 90-90 angle. As you can see in the video, you have to hold your thigh and then straight your leg and you have to hold this position for 30 seconds. You can feel stretch o over the back of the leg and you have to do it for 3 times. The second one is the pyriformis stretch. You have to take the supine position, then you have to bend your one leg and put it on the cross side like in this video then you have to pull it towards your opposite shoulder hold this position for the 30 seconds and do it for three times alternate legs the next one is knee to chest or you can say knee hug in this you have to lie down on your back with knee band then grab your one knee and pull it towards your chest you will feel the stretch over back of the thighs and hold it for 10 seconds perform it on the another side for 10 repetition in the next one you can feel the stretching on the side of the back that is trunk rotation in this you have to resume the supine position with your both the leg bent then you have to rotate knees together on this one side and hold this position for 10 seconds then do it on the alternate side in this you have to take this position and then slowly sit on your leg then you have to stretch your both the hands like in the video but please take a note that if you have a knee problem, then do not try this at your home. Now we will moving forward to the isometric exercises. This exercise will activate the muscle fibers and helps to maintain the strength of your back muscles. Start with the supine position, then bend your both the legs. Now. You have to put your both the hands under your lower back. Then you have to try 
to push your back toward the downward direction and hold this position for 5 to 10 seconds for 10 times. In this isometric exercise, you have to take supine position. Then put one pillow below the hill. Then you have to press your heel on the pillow for the 5 to 10 seconds. Then do it for the 10 times. While having back pain, your back muscle get weakened. By giving them strength training, you can reduce your pain and develop strength and endurance to that muscles. In this bridging exercise, lie down on your back hands at your side with knee band then you have to tighten your abdominal and buttock muscles slowly raise your buttocks towards the ceiling hold this position for 10 seconds and do it for the 10 times now this is the modification of the bridging exercise you can use this exercise for a progression of the bridging exercise Take the supine position and bend your one leg. Then straighten your another leg at 45 angle and hold this position for 10 seconds. Then do it on the another side for 10 times. In this, you have to take this position like in the video. Now you have to rotate your hand to the opposite side and hold this position then 5 to 10 seconds do it on the another side for 10 times so these are some prevention tips you can use it in day to day life while sleeping position then sitting position And lastly, lifting position. Always select push over pull for heavy objects. Take care and keep doing exercises. Thank you everyone.